All righty, thank you very much. Your full weather forecast brought to you by the Furniture Gallery. Make your house a home and shop for all your living room needs at the Furniture Gallery. The Furniture Gallery is a main family-owned company with locations in Augusta, Bangor, Newport, and Wyndham. Already, weight heights are at around one to three feet, according to the buoys this morning. No advisories in effect uh, offshore or on land, for that matter. Any after service being noted further out towards sea, so we're looking pretty good. Already, water temperatures look like this. Upper 50s to lower 60s right now, so water temperature is still rather chilly out there. So if you're going to be near the beaches for the uh, holiday week and the weekend as well, definitely keep that in mind. The water along the ocean is still rather chilly. On land, we've had showers passing through this morning, not only to the north, but also over our neck of the woods this afternoon. We're getting those out of here now, so the rest of the afternoon will be looking pretty good. It's not just us seeing the showers from earlier this morning. Some other parts of the northeast experienced that as well. Those are clearing out now and the rest of the day and even the evening looking pretty good. Let's go on a little field trip here. This right here is Hurricane Barrel that continues to cause some problems as a Category 3 major hurricane. And the latest update has it at around 120 miles per hour, with wind gusts reaching 150 miles per hour at times, moving towards the west northwest at 20 miles per hour. Hurricane warnings up for parts of Cancun and tropical storm warnings up for a few other areas as well. Its projected path does take it towards the west northwest and parts of the Gulf of Mexico and eventually getting close to a landfall as a Category 1 hurricane potentially Monday evening or Monday overnight near parts of Mexico and Texas. They'll, they're starting to prepare for that storm. Now this thing could possibly rapidly intensify into something stronger. So I'll have to monitor this rather closely, especially with the Gulf of Mexico already very warm. Back here at home, no, just a mixture of clouds and sunshine for the rest of the day. And overnight, things clear out of here. Fireworks should be good to go for tonight. We'll have clouds and fog as we head towards Friday morning. Showers and storms possible by Friday afternoon as well. We'll notice those getting out of here for a while by Friday night, but notice they may try to get back in here again by early Saturday morning with locally heavy downpours possible. So for today, we have a mostly cloudy sky now with the rain now out of here with highs in the mid 70s and a south wind getting up to around 20 miles per hour. By tonight, mostly cloudy areas of dense fog, lows in the lower 60s and the wind overall looking nice and calm. Tomorrow, scattered showers and thunderstorms again, highs in the middle 80s and a southwest wind getting up to around 5 miles per hour at times. All right, let's check out your extended forecast brought to you by the Furniture Gallery. Showers and thunderstorms Saturday Saturday with highs in the lower 70s. We're back in the mid 80s Sunday, partly cloudy with a slight chance for showers and thunderstorms. Partly cloudy Monday with highs in the mid 80s.